guys, my name is Jacksepticeye, and welcome, I guess, to, well, welcome back to FNAF, but this one's called Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator, or something like that. I don't know, everyone's calling this FNAF 6, it came out literally just a few hours ago. Right now, for me, it's 4.06 a.m., and I kind of wanted to jump on this now, because I didn't want to wait until tomorrow, and then have to wait a whole nother day again to record it, and then have the whole thing ruined for me by everybody else and telling me exactly what's happening before I even get in playing it so I thought I'd try and jump ahead of it and play it as soon as it came out and give it a bit of a fair shot because some of the other ones I was a bit late getting to them and then by the time I did get to them I had all of my all of my vision of what the games were warped completely by everybody else's interpretations of what it was so I don't know what this is it kind of looks like it's a piss take of the game it doesn't even look like it's a fully formed FNAF game but as we all know, these games like to pull no punches and change everything as it's going along. And <laughs> it's only been out for a few hours and already my social media feeds are inundated with people telling me to play it, so... I'm not too enthusiastic about it because it's more FNAF and we've had a fucking billion of these. And all, everyone kind of rolls their eyes at FNAF these days and it's not really as exciting as it used to be, but... Again, I'm gonna give it a fair shot and make up my own judgments for it, but... Design pizza? Don't mind if I do. You don't even have any pineapple. Come on, what is a pineapple? What is a pizza without any pineapples on it? Still a pizza, but... You know what? I'm just... I'm putting fucking all these on it. <laughs> this sounds like a delicious pizza with all of these. This is the type of pizza I would definitely make in real life. If I had some pineapples, I'd throw them on as well and then I'd have myself a party. But yes, 100%. Go to pizzeria. The fuck? Oh! Hey, I'm shooting pizzas at kids! Take that, you damn kids! Stay in school, don't do drugs! Also, eat lots of pizza and get very fat, apparently. I'm just killing children. I mean, yes, I get it. FNAF has kind of always been about that, but look! I'm Freddy! Also, I'm not too keyed in on the lore of Five Nights at Freddy's. Um, mainly because there's just too much of it and I'm not that invested. So, a lot of this- oh god. Hello, Phantom Bear. A lot of this is probably gonna go over my head. What do you want? Are you blocking my path? Can I stop you? There we go. Here you go, little kitties. Eat up all the pizzas! Tell your parents you came down to Freddy Fazbear's and you got diabetes. And also bad cardiovascular diseases. Okay. Okay, other Freddy. You know what? You know what? Just- Stay up there, okay? I have kids to kill. I have kids to kill and mouths to feed and also- God, you're slow. And ugly. Is that what I look like, really? There we go! Okay. Okay. <laughs> Alright, th this is kind of more of what I was expecting. Oh, and I'm shooting bears. <laughs> oh, awesome! Yes! Fill up the screen with bears! And we're frozen. Oh, shit. Oh, hey, baby! B-A-B-Y, baby! It's been a while, hasn't it? You look different, though. Are you actually baby? Baby was pink and white. You're kind of yellows and oranges and blues and purples. Okay, oh. Oh. If I hit this, if I press play on this and I hear a phone guy going, hello, 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 I'm throwing this game out the window. And I had to download this on Steam, so I technically I'd have to throw my whole fucking computer out the window, and I'll do that. Employees only, paragraph four, results. No, yes, unsure, no, yes. What? Okay, let's press play. Begin tape. Leaving dead space. Three, two, one. The purpose of this tape ah, is to test it. automated response times and reactions from vintage interactive attractions following audio stimuli. If you are playing this tape, that means that not only have you been checking outside at the end of every shift, as you were instructed to do, but also that you have found something that meets the criteria of your special obligations. You've also been checking out that ass. Follow these instructions, document response times, then safely secure the space before leaving. Upon sealing the room, you are not to return. What? Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Oh, I don't like that sound. 
Do you feel like I'm going Document deaf? Results. Document results. That would be a no. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Now it sounds like a bunch of whale noises you used to go to sleep. Document Ooh. results. That's uh, uh death. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Ah, oh, that's worse. I'm going fucking nuts. You're not doing anything. Document results. She's broken. She sucks. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Oh shit! Oh, ho, her eyes moved. Yay, baby's back. Go get him, baby. Go kill the people. Not me though. I'm it's nice. It's a new day. It's your time to shine. It's time to take your career into your own hands. What? You've saved money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. No! <laughs> a gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. <laughs> what are we talking about? We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchise. Uncle Sam Bear! That's right, restaurant ownership and management. Something almost anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Sure, it's a lot of money to invest, but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. <laughs> With your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money you had left over after buying your franchise package. If they're buying. Use it to decorate, buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and much, much more. See blood in his face? Now, let's take a look at a few things that will help you get started as a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. Lay it on Such me. as atmosphere. Making sure your establishment has an inviting <laughs> atmosphere is essential to bringing in new customers. The cheese is so real! Having a lot of entertainment value in your restaurant will ensure that customers come back. Bonus revenue. Coin-operated games and attractions <laughs> can generate additional revenue during the day. Saving money for money in your pocket, ready for reinvestment. Health and safety. There may be times when you purchase something of questionable quality, and we don't blame you. Cutting corners is just good business. <laughs> but there are steps you can take to ensure you don't get sued for it. And that brings us to liability. Being a thrifty shopper is smart. But you be might aware die. That buying things on sale comes with a certain amount of risk. Aside from the daily risk of lawsuits, there's also the risk that something might be hiding inside whatever you just purchased with that steeply discounted price tag. Oh, come on, of really? Course, that would only be a serious danger if there were something outside that's been trying to get in for months now, which we are not confirming to be the case. This concludes the amount of help we are legally obligated to provide. Hey! Remember, you are now the face of the newly rebranded Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Wear that smile with pride, and let's make some money. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death, or dismemberment. Now you're, now you're not even trying. There's no fucking subtlety to this game anymore. It's like, there might be something hiding inside, or something from the outside trying to get in. Wink, wink, nudge, theories! We get it, okay? How to... A two-step guide to restaurant management. Use catalog mode to purchase items and animatronics. Am I actually making my own... Ah, oh, I'm ready. I'm actually making my own pizzeria. Let's get started. Ah, look at you. Let's see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great, that should be more than enough. Now let's get started. On your left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. Ah. When you're finished shopping, click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between Catalog Mode and Blueprint Mode as often as you like before <laughs> opening your doors to the public. Oops. When you're ready to open your restaurant for business for the day, click the button labeled Finished in Blueprint Mode. Give it a try and do some shopping. Thanks! Also, I remember you from FNAF World! Yeah, everybody else forgot because 
good idea. Uh, <laughs> I can't believe the fucking fan is here. I mean, I have to buy the fan, right? You either already own this item or an upgraded version. Ooh! Pick a duck! A little paddling pool! Oh, Bucket Bob's not available. Mr. Can Do! Mr. Hugs! <laughs> Just these old pan stand. Ah, oh, the paper pals! I'm about you guys. Okay. <laughs> this is weird. I don't know what the fuck is going on, but I'm into it. Okay. A stage! Stage for one light animatronic. Bling, 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 bling! Bye, 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 sell! Lose, lose, lose! Alright. Ah, my stuff is all in. Very good. Wait, don't I get to place these shits? Oh. I get to place them, but everything else is already done. I want to place the paddling pool right on top of the stage. Then no animatronics can get on it, and then we're all fine. Okay, I'll put you here. Shazang! I got a Faz rating! Playtest! Adorable. Beautiful. That's what that song was. Can I do anything? Hit the fan. Clangy clang. This is a weird sponsorship offer. Fight me pop soda. Have a poppin' good time with Fish Time Pop. Fish Time Pop Inc. is offering to pay for advertisements and subs. Cool. I got $250. I'm going back to my catalog to make my place look even better. Bye. Ooh, I'm gonna go into Stan's budget stuff. I'll buy me some fucking speakers. Oh, I could have bought those ones. <laughs> okay, I have $95 left. Mom told me not to spend it all in one place, but fuck mom, what does she know? I'm a businessman now. Look at my place, it is so cool. Man! Looking snazzerific there, Jackaroo! Probably should have bought an animatronic, but you know what? That's the downfall of the FNAF games. Five Nights at Freddy's would be a lot better if they just didn't buy any animatronics. Put the kids up on stage, let them be their own animatronics. Um, I don't want a larger floor plan. I'm finished. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I just got a load of money and spent it all in one place. Your restaurant is now officially open. Awesome. That doesn't mean your job is finished, however. <coughs> you have a lot of work to do while patrons eat their pizza in the other room. Oh shit, I turned it From off. From your terminal, you have supplies to buy, papers to print, and repairs to make. Once you've taken care of all the items on your to-do list, you can log off for the day and get out of there. Money for supplies and repairs comes out of petty cash, so don't worry about it coming out of your pocket. We've got you covered. The only money you have to worry about is if you choose to upgrade any of the equipment in your office. Now, on to other matters. Okay. Something to be aware of is that the ventilation system and your terminal are pretty loud and may prevent you from hearing things in adjoining air vents. That won't be a problem if there is nothing in the vents. However, if you feel that something might be in the vents, you have a few tools at your disposal to protect yourself. Oh, Jesus. You can shut off your terminal and the ventilation system at any time to decrease the amount of attention you're drawing to yourself. Also, shut up! the light directly into a vent will most likely prevent anything from jumping out. You also have three tools available from the terminal itself. There is a motion detector, an audio decoy, and a secondary ventilation unit. Keep in mind, however, that you can only have one of these active at any given time. Okay. Now get to it. Simply log off when you've completed your tasks for the day, and you can go get some coffee. Okay, I fucking no idea what I'm doing. Activate silent ventilation. That's not silent! Okay, did I order anything yet? Order cups! Oh, fucking dial up! Okay, done. I 
to go through all of these. So I'm in here, right? Activate. Oh, activate motion scanning. Oh, it's not just doing it on its own. Got it. God, you're fucking slow. Are you- are you still scanning? Are you just telling me that nothing's showing up? Okay. I'm gonna order some napkins. Um, they're important. I need them. Kids. Kids like napkins. Kids love napkins, actually. It's really weird. You think you need toys for kids? You actually just need napkins. Kids love that shit. Okay. Am I doing things correctly? Uh, is- is this good? I have a printer in my office, apparently. Okay, Jesus Christ. I guess it did, this did take place uh, a million years ago. I don't know if you're actually scanning stuff properly. So I'm assuming that something's going to show up here, and then I press audio to get it into an adjacent room. Maybe. Who the fuck knows? Maybe we'll get jump scared! Okay, I don't know if I can click off this, or if it'll revert that. Let's turn off that for a second. Oh, I can hear myself think. Yeah, it does turn it off. Okay. Printing! Printing paper! Oh, it's getting warm in here. Uh, turn the air AC back on. I'm getting very hot and bothered. Okay. Ah, oh, unclog toilets. I don't want to do that. Oh, it's nice and breezy in here now. We're back down to 60 degrees. I'm gonna turn it off again. I don't want to waste power. We're on a budget here, people. I only get five dollars. You know how I'm doing all this shit in five dollars, but okay. Am I hearing something? Okay, AC's back on! Oh, thank god! I was dying in here! I was dying! Is this it? Is this the last thing I have to do? Great job! It looks like you're getting the hang of this. Now let's just focus on getting you through your first week. Okay! There's a big party here Saturday. And you should view that day as your ultimate test. Make it through Saturday, and you will have proven yourself as the successful entrepreneur that we all know you can be. But I don't want that! I don't care about a pizza chain! I- I care about eating pizza! I don't care about owning pizza! Congratulations on completing your first day. Thanks, man! However, your job isn't over just yet. There is another aspect to your end-of-day routine. And that is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. Things are found here quite often. And while we aren't sure why, oh God. what we do know is that they can be used for parts, which can mean a much needed revenue boost before starting your next day. Of course, as with everything else in this line of work, those benefits come with risk. The sure. safest thing to do is to throw it back outside, but then you get no money for the salvage. Choose to keep it, and you run the risk of certain negative consequences, namely death, should the item in question not be as docile as it first appeared. Are you letting me pause now? If you now? do decide to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance checklist. During this testing phase, check on the animatronic frequently. If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every use over three, however, 
will decrease the item's salvage value. I have a taser! Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage. Or, if you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. I would like that. Please make your choice now. Uh, proceed with salvage, throw it back into the alley. Bye. <laughs> Don't forget Saturday. You want them all to be in one place. Wait, I can actually just throw it back into the alleyway? What the fuck? <laughs> Hey, it works, man! <laughs> New lawsuit zero! No one- no one's, uh, doing litigation on me. I only have $307. Of course. Okay, so we need to get stuff for the party on Saturday, right? Fruity Maze Arcade, entertainment four, entertainment bonus revenue. Mmm. Let's keep that in mind. Okay, I'ma buy you. Uh, cha-ching! Uh, dumpster diver, wait, wait, do you have any animatronics in you? Stage, ooh, nice stages. Novelty traffic lights! A happy frog. Damn, I can't buy you. Oh, you're cute! Mr. Hippo, that's Bonnie with a, a reskin. Ned Bear. <laughs> oh, I should have saved some of my money. Why didn't I fucking go to you guys first? I am Candy Cadet. I look like Alpha from Power Rangers. Ay, 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 ay. Okay, I guess I'm down to fucking wait. Unless someone wants to give me a, a advertising sponsorship offer, Marty's plungers. Nothing goes down that can't come up. Ew. Hell yeah! I'm going back into my catalog and I'm buying these fucking animatronos. Who do we want? Do we want contestant number one? Why? You were fine before. Why are you all unavailable now? You know what? I'm buying Alpha! Fuck you guys! <laughs> this happy dancing motherfucker. Um, okay, I can buy way more shit. Buy you! Uh, buy all the things! I am going to be... New catalog unlocked. It reminds me of Little Inferno. It's Little Inferno just for me. Whoa! Is that Foxy's? Oh god, no, they're all zip. Oh, that's horrifying! I would not want to be in that thing as a child. Oh, carnival hoops! Riding rockets! Lemonade clown, also known as stay away children, that's a stranger danger pedophile. Oh god, it gets worse. You're not so bad, neon jukebox. Medical stations, I feel like those look like voting booths. Security doors, very handy. Rockstar Freddy, Rockstar Bonnie, Rockstar Chico. Chico, you've seen better days. And Rockstar Foxy. I call, I like to call them Foxstar. Oh, he's got a little parrot! You are a pirate after all. Um, okay. Didn't I buy a fucking alpha? Badoink! Badoink. Look at this! Revenue 12, Entertainment 16, H and Sa. I don't know what that is on the top right. Um, Atmosphere 10. I feel like we've got a fucking badass place going on in here. I've got the best pizzeria in town. Ain't no one getting close to me. Uh This shit again. Order your cups. See if I care. Okay, let's act- Fucking Christ, go away! Stupid skip ads, I get it. It's making fun of YouTube. Scan. Scanning. Scanning. I still don't know how this whole system works, but... You know, it's fine. I'm just over here ordering cups and plates. I'm just trying to make a living, man. I got kids at home. I gotta feed them. Okay, I get it now. I get why getting the sponsorships is a bad idea, because they interrupt everything else. That's fine, maybe I want to be interrupted. I want to see some of the game. I want to see what animatronics are going to scare me. What animatronos are lying around? I mean, jump scares are never fun, but I feel like it might be a hoot and holler. Let's 
Turn off this for a sec. I heard something. At least I thought I did. Hmm. Vince, can you come back on? It's hot as balls in here! I honestly have no idea if I'm doing any of this right. Fit the flyers have a bar mitzvah to promote. Okay. Everything's fine. I'm just over here printing posters, man. I'm a regular old Quiznos. Kinkos. FedEx. Print shop. Is anything actually happening? I feel like I'm being terrible at this game, and I'm just getting lucky. Let's just back up away from the screen a small bit so it doesn't scare me. Okay. Maintenance. Unclog those toilets. Fucking farty bastards clogging up all my toilets all the time. Because I keep feeding them that abomination pizza that I made at the start. But it's good! I like that pizza! It's very refreshing! It's different than all the pizzas those other places are having. Okay? Replace bulbs and I'm done, right? Right? What is happening? Am I- am I supposed to be jump scared? I know it's going on, it's closing time! Oh, but I now I gotta s stick my face in a robot's face. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage. Hey, it's spring or, trap! If you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it. I mean, I could just keep throwing them back into the thing. Salvage value a thousand. Okay. Proceed you have with salvage. to proceed with the maintenance checklist. Oh, Jesus. Remember, use your company-issued taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state if you feel that it's becoming unstable or aggressive. Okay. You can only use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic. I'm ready to taste some value. ass! Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Begin with this shit! It sounds like aliens! Document results. Oh! Be Get back there, bitch! Tase them! <laughs> that was fun. Again, audio prompt in three, two, one. Second audio prompt. I probably should have been looking at you, shouldn't I? <laughs> Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. I don't like that you're moving so close. I actually don't like that you're moving at all. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three. I'm gonna tase you back right now. Not liking it. Begin that audio prompt. Two. One. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Did you move? I want one of the audio document things to just be like, Baby, you're a firework! And the 
Kevin Ryan just starts dancing. This is a long one. Document results. Oh, this is it. It's going to get me. <laughs> Always come back. What? what? <laughs> and something is loose in your pizzeria. Oh, it's those fat kids again from the start that I overfed with my abomination pizza. Abominita, as I like to call it. Wait, I got the salvage revenue? Still have zero lawsuits though, so that is a okie dokie on my regard. <laughs> okay, well I'm gonna leave this video here on FNAF Pizzeria Freddy Fazbear Simulator. I have absolutely no idea what to think. This is a weird game. I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm into it. It seems so all over the place and I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. Though the other games they did get a bit, like the first few nights were a bit easy as well. So did I get caught? Oh! Oh, okay, so nothing's actually going to be walking around in my vents until I fail that because then it said something is loose in your pizzeria So was I actually fine all those other nights anyway? And now because I did that wrong, which again, I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing um, So because I failed that is it loose in the pizzeria now so when I go into the thing I'll actually have to scan for stuff now Funny that it's Springtrap because these mechanics are exactly the ones to keep Springtrap away. Was it Springtrap? Yes. In FNAF 3. You had to use the music to guide him into different rooms. Um, okay. Um, let me know what you guys think. I don't know if this is supposed to be taken seriously or not. And I don't know what the whole end goal is or even the timeline where any of this takes place. But all I know is that I'm making a ball or ass. Unavailable. Why? I'm making, a, I'm making a fucking baller pizzeria. Kids are gonna love it. That's a three liability risk though. And I'm, I have no lawsuits yet. So I'm trying to keep that up. I'm trying to keep my, my litigation record clean as a whistle. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, punch the like button in the face. Like a boss. And my face all right. Whoosh, whoosh. Well, thank you guys. Now we'll see all you dudes. I want to be as happy as that dancing bear in the corner. Hmm.